guys welcome back to another video thanks for watching it has been four months i did have my baby girl on march 16th so we are so extremely blessed and so happy with our baby girl so hopefully soon i can give you guys like a labor and delivery story if you guys would like to see that or just any other video just let me know down below and i can try to film that for you guys but for now just stay tuned for her nursery tour and her name is real all right, and then moving on to her shelves. So I did get these off of Amazon. I think they were also $30. So really good price as well. So I thought these were super, super cute here. Um, you're probably gonna hear like super, super cute a million times. <laughs> I'm gonna try not to, but um, I thought these are so neat. Um, since these she can actually play with when, so she's, when she's a little bit bigger. She can actually play with these because they move around, so that would be so fun when she's a little bit bigger and she can actually move with those. And then, um, this was also gifted to us. I believe they also got these from Hobby Lobby. I forgot to mention, um, these were from Hobby Lobby. I did remember seeing them. And then, moving down, I put her bows here. This was also gifted to us. It was from Hobby Lobby, um as well and so i thought her bows would work out perfect right here i guess you kind of use it for whatever you want but i was like eh, you know her bows would look cute like that so and then we have our nursing chair so or just reclining chair reading chair whatever um i'm pretty sure there's a name for it i'm just it's not popping in my head right now <laughs> um but yeah so i got this pillow at home goods super cute wasn't too pricey I don't believe I don't remember the price but yeah and then um I also got this on Amazon just a little blanket for it um and then moving on over here I have this full of like stuffed animals for her that were like gifted from family and friends so yeah she's gonna have plenty of stuffed animals and this is just from another cozy blanket to have just in case when it's cold you know just to wrap on a blanket if we want to read to her. And then I usually have her munchkin diaper pillow right here. But it's in our room right now. Since she is sleeping with us still with her bassinet and everything. So we just have that in our room. But it will go here when she sleeps in here again. And then just going back on top of her dresser. So this was the one that was a little bit more of a splurge. Um, her changing pad. I think this was for also from Amazon. I think it was... I want to say $79.99. So this one was an actual splurge, but I love it. It's so, so cute. And I believe it wraps up her her dresser um, so, so, so nicely and so cute. I am so in love with it. Um, but yeah, and then I just put have one of these changing pad covers. I think these are lifesavers. I will definitely be putting this in my newborn essentials. Um, they are just... You can just wash these, they're machine washable, and I do have quite a few, so um, they work out so, so well. And I believe I also got these on Amazon. And then here is her little diaper caddy. I brought it out here, I usually have this in our um, bedroom, since that's where she sleeps right now with us, like I said. Um, so I just have diapers in here. Um, I do really like the Costco wipes right now, they're my favorite, but I also use... The water wipes as well so I have some water wipes and then um, some passy wipes and then in, like I said another one of those um, changing pad covers which are just so convenient like I said you just roll them out this one there's I guess two styles on Amazon this one's a little more thinner and then this one's a little more I guess you can say more of a knit material I guess on the back but they're both waterproof which is awesome so I just like roll that up and I keep it in here we have it next to me on my nightstand in the bedroom so it works out really good and I have like a burp cloth um, a bib and then I have her nail filer in here some hand sanitizer some diaper cream some lotion some saline spray, um, I got some nipple butter, and some, some chapstick, and um, a thermometer. So I have those, and moving on to her dresser, so this is a dresser we got from 
Walmart, actually a lot of places, even Amazon, I think sold this one, but we decided to just buy it through Walmart. So yeah, I thought, I didn't want anything too big, so I thought this is the perfect size since um, her nursery is a little bit on the smaller side, or house is in general on the smaller side, so I thought this was perfect size. Um, so in here, so at the first row, I just have some diapers, um, some wipes, and then I just have random stuff like thermometer, I have a little diaper cream brush that I have not used, some more diaper um, rash cream, some gas drops, some more gas drops, or I guess this is gripe water, sorry. Um, and then moving on to here, I have her clothes. Well, mostly her onesies, I guess you can say, and some of her, like, sleep clothes. Um, these are some of her, like, outfits. Like, I guess, um, what do you call? Like, jumpsuits? Yeah, her little jumpsuits for, like, the summer right now. And to her bottom drawer, I have all of her, like, little pants, her shorts. You know, organize them a little bit better. Um, her socks, some more, like, I think these are high socks and leggings ones. Some more PJs. And then up here, I have just some rent, like, her, I guess, more of necessity things. So, these are, like, some of the no sucker things I know there's probably a name for them but can't think of it right now um, and then her hair brushes she doesn't really have that much hair but you know I guess I can try <laughs> I can pretend but and this is also um, her I use this to wash her hair it's also really good for cradle cap I think this is from Frida baby I think a lot of the things on here are from I have from Frida baby it's not sponsored, I promise. I just had, like, a care package thing that I got. Um, and I have some, like, coconut oil as well. Some more nail clipper things. Um, I got some baby safe cotton swabs. Um, this is also another nail clippers that I haven't opened. Some more passies. Um, her nose Frida. Some passy clips. More passy wipes. And these are, like, from little samples I've gotten from, um, just, like, random, like, I know, like, Amazon gave me some, like, the Target registry. So, all of those were, like, awesome, like, to try out things. So, I really like those. So, I highly recommend you be on the lookout for those. I know Amazon has a registry box. Um, I think Walmart does. But, yeah, those are all really helpful if you wanted to, like, try out new things. And then in here, I have, like, some of her swaddles, blankets, um, some more burp cloths, just receiving blankets. And then this is, I guess, my junk drawer right now, just her random stuff. I need to definitely organize that and just kind of figure out where I'm going to put things. Hi, Mama. <laughs> And then this is her rug. So I kind of went through two of them. This is the one I went with because I thought it went with them. It went best, you know, with everything. So I went with that one. I think I got this one at Hobby Lobby as well. And it was super, super um, inexpensive. I think it was only, I want to say, it was $30 for its price. But I got it on 50% off um, for $15. So very inexpensive. Um, and then back to her chair, which it, I didn't mention, it does move, so it's awesome for that. And then moving on. So before I show you guys this side of the room, I know you guys already saw her, her name over here. Um, so our daughter's name is Aurora Lee. So um, if you guys want to know a little background of why we chose that name, let me know. And I'll let you guys know probably in another video. But just to kind of sum it up, it's a name we both loved and we both agreed on. So we decided on that name for our baby girl. So we completely love it. So yeah, and I didn't mention where I got this, but it was an online shop. So I'll have to, I will try to link it for you guys if you guys are interested. But I thought it was so beautiful. I loved how it turned out. Um, but yeah. Alright, and so moving on to this side of the room. I got these little baskets, so they're just plain old, like, baskets. I guess these ones are a little bit thinner. I guess you wouldn't even call these baskets, but, um, I just got them from random thrift stores. I didn't really know what to do on this side, so I figured, I was like, well, this is super cheap and expensive, you know, and it's a cute idea. I saw it on Pinterest. 
Um, and I was inspired by other nurseries as well, so I thought that was like a cute little touch to this side of her room by her crib. So, and then this was also a mobile we had on our registry that was gifted by family. So we're so, so thankful for that. And I just thought it went so perfect with everything. Her was so, so cute with her nursery. So, um, and then moving on. So this is her name, her little name plaque that I, I believe I ordered on Etsy. It was one of the Etsy shops so I can try to see and look back on my emails, like which one I had done it on. But they did such a good job. And I think I got it for, I want to say... $25 I got it when they were having a sale um 50% off on their items so I took advantage of that and I ordered it right away and I love how it turned out and it's like the perfect size so yeah and then moving on to her crib so this is a crib we had in our target registry which was also gifted from family from us but yeah, so we have her crib, and then this was her sheet that I absolutely love that was also gifted from family. Um, but it's from Amazon, so it was super, super cute, and it is a muslin material, so it's super, super breathable. She's not sleeping in here yet, but when she is, I feel a lot better since, you know, it is really breathable. And this is the Newton mattress um, that we got since they say is completely breathable and it pretty much is like we me and my fiance we tested it and it is breathable so we feel a lot better with that more comfortable you know when she when she finally starts sleeping in here and like I said since she's not sleeping in here I just have like these little fluffy pillows that I think they were from Walmart and they were I think it was when they were having a huge Christmas sale so I got them for only I want to say it was six fifty each. I think their original price was like thirteen, I believe, like thirteen or fourteen. So yeah, so that's her crib. Um, and then on the bottom, I kind of just have um these little storage things that I got from Amazon. They were, I believe, twenty dollars each, but they are so so convenient. They fit like um bunch of stuff so I actually have her snuggle me lounger in there so she's in but yeah I got these from Amazon they're only 20 bucks each and they hold so much things so I have a lot of her like extra blankets since it is summer now um she's not really using too many blankets right now like um so we have a lot of her blankets um just like other I guess miscellaneous items and then I have like her love every box I don't know why I still have it but you know, figure out what I'm going to do with it, if I'm going to put it away or throw it away, I don't know. But yeah, so I just have her, like, um, love everything right here, her love every plagian, which was also gifted to us from family, we're so, so thankful. Um, she uses that every single day, we do her little tummy time, um, and then moving on, so I have that, this was also gifted to us, this was from Hobby Lobby, um, so I just keep that up there. Um, I guess I, eventually I can put it on the door, I guess, if I want. But I have that up there just hanging. And then in her little basket, I have this little basket right here. Her little basket, I have this little pillow. Because she did have really bad reflux. So this is what we used to, like, prop her up when we were changing her diaper. So that was also from Amazon. So let me know if you want me to link that. Um, and then I just have her um, play mat. So I just kind of just take it out when she's ready to play. And then I have some more of those changing pad covers. And then moving on. So I got this little, um, I guess, cube dresser thing um, from Target. So I thought it was very convenient. I just, since it is a little bit smaller, I just wanted a little space where I can put some more items. So I thought this worked out perfect. Off. So in here I have some, like, I guess, nursing stuff. Some, like, my manual breast pump things. Some bottles um, that we have sampled. Um, and then some machine washable nursing pads. Alright, and then moving down here. So right here I just, I got this little basket from the thrift store. I still not too sure what I want to do with it so I kind of just kept it here and it's just holding her like little milestone cards um, for each month and then moving down I have a little moon and these I got from Hobby Lobby so I thought those were really cute and then moving on to the next drawer I just have a bunch of her bath stuff so this kind of just pulls out so it's super convenient and then her bath towels uh, washcloths and some more lotions. I get. I think this is hand sanitizer refill, 
And then moving on to this drawer. Um, I just kind of have some more miscellaneous items. Some like nursing covers, car seat covers. Um, some like washing bags. Her snuggle me um, cover which I should probably put away. And then um, I have like this like head support thing. And then I have moving down here that little giraffe like it's a little play one as well. So I got that from Hobby Lobby and then this was just something random that I picked up from the dollar store the other day. <laughs> Look at me already um, decorating for fall but I thought it was so cute because it had an A on it so I was like oh I had to get it. So and then this was also gifted from us for my sister I believe so she got us that. I just need to put an actual picture of Aurora in there but those are her actual little hand, her handprint. We kind of failed but you know we got something and then her little foot. So, yeah, and then moving down to her last drawer, I kind of have, like, some of her little toys right now. Um, oh, that popped off. Um, I have some of her little toys, and this is from her play gym as well. So I just keep her toys in there. And then I guess I didn't mention, um, these little box drawers, I got them from Amazon as well. Like I said, I can link these, um, if you'd like to know. And I'll try to go back and find them. Um, but yeah, I thought it was super cute and this turned out it was so cute. So I'm so happy about that So I love how that turned out And then moving on to this little corner. So I got this little basket at home goods um, It was super inexpensive. I think I got it on sale. I just um, I think it was around I want to say $15 so it wasn't too bad and then I didn't know what to use it for at first, so I just figured, I was like, oh, I can just put her books in there. So I just have all her books in there, that little corner. All right, and then moving on over here. So baby girl kind of does share her nursery a little bit with mom. So me and my fiance, we kind of compromised. We figured um, since he does a lot of more um, work, he has his desk in our bedroom. And I moved um, my vanity slash desk into her room since it kind of would, I guess, look a little better. And it wouldn't be so, I guess, out of place looking, I don't know. So and we figured it would look a little better and just work out better. But um, eventually when she is sleeping in here, we'll have to figure something out. Or when we move, because um, since it's not very baby friendly, it is a little dangerous, you know, for babies since it is completely mirrored. But... I love love my vanity and you know and it works out so so she shares a little bit of this with mommy <laughs> um but yeah moving on to here I have her little laundry hamper so I like to um split our clothes so I like to keep her clothes um separate from ours just to kind of keep track of like the laundry and doing her laundry um but yeah and then this is my diaper bag that my mom gifted to me um, it was also from Amazon, so I will link that if you guys would like. And then moving on to her closet. Um, so she has lots of clothes and dresses, so she is so, so spoiled, so, so blessed that a lot of family and friends, um, they gave us so many cute clothes, like her baby shower, and yeah. And then this was also gifted from family, so thank you so much. Um, so I figured it's I do need to organize this really badly, <laughs> but um, this kind of has I guess um, Some miscellaneous items, but pretty much I have like more of her bows in here and then um, Some more bibs and then I have like her little hats in here some more socks some little shoes She doesn't have too many shoes and moving up here. We have some more miscellaneous items that were also gifted to us um, We have like a her seat cover and then her book that I got that I really need to start and moving up here we have a little bit more of miscellaneous items like her boppy lounger she no longer uses and then my breast pump and then some more some more diapers and some more wipes All right and then that's everything for her closet hey guys so that wraps up her nursery tour so thank you so much for watching um, let me know down below if you guys would like to see any other video, like her labor and delivery story. Um, unfortunately, we weren't able to <laughs> vlog too much um, during her birth because it was literally so, so fast. So I might do a video explaining what went down because <laughs> it was so fast and it was 
I honestly had a great experience so we're so happy about that and also like I said um, be sure to let me know also if you would like me to link some of the items down below and I'll try my best to look for them but yeah so thank you so much for watching bye <music>